Unit number six. In this unit, we shall study the following two chapters. A. Ores, minerals, extractive metallurgy, and B. Principles of qualitative inorganic analysis. Let us begin with the first chapter. That is A. Ores, minerals, and extractive metallurgy. In this chapter, we shall learn extractive metallurgy of the following metals with the description of their commonly occurring ores and minerals. Only chemical principles and reactions excluding the industrial details. Number one, silver and gold cyanide process number two magnesium and aluminium electrolytic reduction method third copper and lead self reduction method finally the fourth iron and tin carbon reduction method introduction most of the metals are obtained from the earth's crust where some of the metals are found in the native state like gold, platinum, but large number of metals are found in the combined states, which are called minerals. Thus naturally occurring chemical substances in the earth's crust, which are obtained by mining, are called minerals. Hence a metal may be found in many minerals irrespective of its percent content in that. But out of these several minerals, only a few are viable to be used for the extraction of that metal. Such minerals are called ores. Thus, ore is a mineral from which a metal can be extracted by scientifically convenient and economic method. For example, aluminium is found in the nature in the form of following minerals. Bauxite, Al2O3, 2H2O, Felspar, KalSi3O8, Cryolite, Na3ALF6 Alunite K2SO4 Al2SO4 Hull Thrives 4 ALOH Hull 3 Turquoise ALPO4 ALOH3 H2O etc. But aluminium is extracted from bauxite hence bauxite is the main ore of aluminium. Further, an ore is usually contaminated with many earthly or undesired materials as impurities, which is known as gang. The entire scientific and technological process employed for the extraction of metal from its core is known as metallurgy, which involves the following three major steps. First, concentration of ore. Second, isolation of metal from its concentrated ore. And third, purification of metal. Depending upon the nature of the ore and the metal, there are various methods available for carrying out the above three steps which we shall study with the individual metal extraction. So let us begin with metallurgy of silver, the cyanide process. Occurrence It is generally found in the earth's crust in the following form. Number one, silver glass or argentite AG2S. Second, ruby silver 
Ag2S, Sp2S3, third, Hall Silver AgCl. But it is mainly extracted from silver glands Ag2S, hence it is its main ore. Extraction of silver from silver glands. The various steps involved in the metallurgy are as shown in the flow chart given below. Powdered ore is first concentrated by flotation method so as to get concentrated ore. Then it is subjected to cyanide treatment where we get impure silver that is finally subjected to electrolytic purification so as to get pure silver.